Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? Uh, this is my reaction to um, Sleazy P. Martini had the thing, Heavy Header News, where he would take like, stuff from the internet and then throw his two cents about it. I didn't know about this. Tool was coming out with like this collectible like CD pack. No, I think it was CD. I thought it was a vinyl. Vinyl? Or oh, the vinyl? Oh, yeah. vinyl. Well, vinyl, I meant. Uh, Fear of Binoculum, or so, and they're charging $810 for it. Yes. And I know why people are so excited about it. It's a limited edition collectible autograph. You're gonna, you're gonna overcharge for all that stuff. Yeah. I mean, I'm not, I'm not excited about it. I just say, I, I, I love Tool. I don't know any Tool stuff, so I don't give to Oh, I love Tool. I mean, but... You know, a friend of mine's musician said, you know why they call themselves Tool? What's that? So people will be walking around with tool on their t-shirt or on their oh, shirts. Oh, really? No, as in, hey, he's a tool. Oh, well, that's a cool. I know I said uh, Brink and stuff like Brink said he loves tool too, but he wouldn't pay that much. But John was saying that he did a little more research yet because I just saw I saw the video. What was it? Wednesday night or Thursday night? Cause I saw it. I mean, well, I saw the video on my subscription feed the night before, and I was you know I had to go to work and stuff like that, so I didn't watch till the next night. And I shared it and stuff like that. I said, that's okay. He, John said people are buying it up. It's around sell it, for two grand on yeah, eBay. Yeah, sell for two See, grand on eBay. Thing. It's a collectible. You're going to pay more for certain things. I've got a sword I paid $1,000 for. Now it's worth over $5,000. Yeah. Okay, it's a collectible. Yeah. It's like comic books. You know, people pay, might pay a lot for a certain type of comic. I uh, saw so one years ago, I'd love to have it. It was a special type of printing. I forget what it was now. Yeah. It was something rare. It was a lot of money, but it's probably worth like 10 times the price now. I think lithiograph or something like yeah. that. So, you know, there's collectible things. They charge a lot for it. Yeah. I know. It's just like... I don't know why people get a, ooh, that's a lot of money. Well, I mean, I, 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 wouldn't, I wouldn't pay that much no, for a person. Yeah. Yeah, but I mean, well, some would you people pay will. Much for a sword, probably not. No. I did. <laughs> but the, but the sword of Damocles, maybe. But you know, that's about it. <laughs> it's a sword. It's got yeah. rubies and oh, that platinum sounds cool. And it's got oh, like that a, sounds cool. Two thousand years of history etched into the. Oh, laser that's etching. that. That sounds pretty cool. I mean, you know, something it's whatever that, like floats good, your but, boat. Yeah, whatever floats your boat, but boy. Yeah, that don't float my boat. I like sleeping. But I mean, I like, well, I'll tell you, Sleepy P. Martini said this right there. I mean, he's like the manager for Guar. And I mean, I mean, his videos are pretty interesting. He just gives his two cents about stuff like that. But he was saying, like, you're a big Tool fan. You buy the album. Just whenever you pass away, have it end up in a goodwill. Could your grandkids see it and say, who the fuck's Tool? Or you, you sell know? it and make a fuckload of money. Yeah, I mean, by, I doubt they'll probably want to know who they are. Unless you taught them, right? Yeah. yeah, well, I don't know. I know. I don't know. I know bands my grandparents listen to, so. Oh, yeah. I mean, maybe. But I don't know if. Maybe. They might have that cult appeal. I don't know. If we're oh, I'm just... surprised my sister's kids uh, knew who Alice Cooper was when I went to Alice Cooper when he played Erie last time. Oh, that's She's cool. She's playing again, I think, this month. And uh, during school's out, they fired off the cannons and confetti shot out, and I grabbed a ribbon, oh, using that awesome. ribbon to grab their presence, and oh, they were geeking awesome. out. I didn't know that. Awesome. I assumed they wouldn't know who Alice Cooper yeah, was. Yeah, that's true. They did. Yeah. Well, that's very impressive. They're good for them that they know something. I mean, because sometimes some kids know the oldest, sometimes they don't. I know my sister had a friend. I know my sister had a friend. I mean, like, 30-something. She didn't even know who Foreigner was. It's like, oh, my goodness. Depends on what people listen to. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> but that's our two cents about uh, uh, tool charging. Uh, $810 for a new collectible item. Oh, I mean, it's like custom art and stuff like that on it. And, like, eh, I don't know. <laughs> but... I was going to do a video about it, and we're doing a video oh, about it yeah. now. I think at the concert. At the concert, yeah. But definitely, I definitely want to do a video about it. I just didn't know when I was going to do it. But I mean, uh, like, so that Sleepy Marty, he has live streams. He had like over 400 some odd people on his live streams. I mean, I wish I had that many, but that would be a nightmare because the chat would go so by so fast, you couldn't see it all. Cause I see people have like real people have those live streams, 
the live chat goes by too fast, you can't comment and everything like that. Hey, aren't you adding my comment? There's too many comments there. We probably don't. They don't bother with that, I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> but still an interesting channel, though. I mean, you know, I guess that's what he's doing now on the off time for the band uh, Guar. And then he did a little septum. I just saw something they're doing on tour. I think they're releasing a new album soon. Oh, cool. I definitely want to review that new album, yeah. Tour. But, I mean, it's interesting because they were talking about... Uh, He's saying, like, Tool's been out 30 out years, like, over 30 years. Well, I know Band of Bell 30, like, Guar's been over that long. Yeah, and they, Guar, yeah, they got something. Oh, yeah, it's in the yeah. 80s. And then uh, they're talking about, like, uh, the band, they call them the Tool Army and stuff. Well, then they're talking about the maggots or the Bohabs and stuff, and that was their name for Guar members. And the maggots or the mag colony were for people listing the Cannibal Corpse. So, so there we have for John and I's uh, two cents about Tool's. Selling their new uh, album for like over 800 bucks. So I hope you like the video. Bye. Till next time, please. Take care, my legion.